This is Natasha with On the Grand Boxing talking with Zachary Woolman. I, I mean, I have to, I have to reveal your nickname because it's probably my favorite that has ever, ever, ever been invented. This is Kid Yamaka, ladies and gentlemen. What's up, everyone? <laughs> How did you get such a crazy nickname like Kid, Kid Yamaka? Um, you know, I was clowning around uh, Eric Brown, and Freddie Roach, and my trainers, and we were clowning around one day and. Uh, Eric was wearing a big diamond chain that's Roberto Garcia's, and I was like, hey, Coach Diamond, and he was like, what, Kid Yamaka? And Freddie heard it, and Eric loved it, so they kept the nickname, and uh, I'm a Jewish fighter fighting out of L.A., so I got a big Star David tattooed on my stomach, so Kid Yamaka stuck with everyone. That's awesome. Now, Zachary, you are about to make your pro debut yeah. on December 1st. First, um, how are you feeling about that? Good. I'm uh, fighting on the Golden Boy Show, and uh, I'm really grateful they took me in. And uh, um, I feel good. I feel like I have a great team. I'm with uh, Steve Bash and Anthony Catanzaro, and uh, I had a lot of help um, coming in even from professional fighters like Paulie Malinaji and you know Freddie and Eric have been with me this whole time. And uh, if they say I'm ready to go, then that means I'm ready to go. You've also had a great amateur career, Zach. How many Golden Gloves have you fought in and won? Uh, I fought in two Golden Gloves. I fought in Texas on the border of Mexico and Texas when I was 14. I won it then and then I won it in 09 in Los Angeles. I won the Golden Gloves out there too. How many amateur fights have you had? Um, not even too many. Probably about 18 or 19. Not, not even the biggest amateur career. I, I, uh, I started again when I got with Freddie when I was 19. Uh, I'm 23 now, making my pro debut, and uh, 19 fights in there. Wow. Now, what weight division are you debuting at? I'm debuting at uh, 147, but uh, my opponent decided he wants 148, so that's what we're doing. <laughs> so you gave him the one pound because you are not afraid, are you? No big deal to me. Got it. Now, 147 is kind of an interesting weight class. Who do you kind of model yourself after? Who who do you have your sights set on? Who have my sights set on? Whoever's in front of me for now. Um, you know, to talk about a big name making my pro debut is kind of crazy, but uh, I can tell you who I like. You know, uh, fighters like Paulie, uh, Miguel Cotto. Um, I think Floyd Mayweather is great. Well, you know, all <laughs> opinions aside. Um, I just want to go. I may go down to 140 uh, at some point. I just got real big legs, so uh, yeah. Yeah, those are famous uh, calves at the wild card gym. So uh, we'll see how it works. But right now, making 148 is not a problem. Um, I, I I just want to get it get it going. Got it. What are you anticipating to be the biggest differences between amateur fighting and pro fighting? Oh, I'm I'm like so relieved about this. Um, the pace, because I've always trained at a wild card, and Freddie's always put me in like my first day wild card. He put me with uh, Craig McEwen and Abdullah. Uh, what's Abdullah? Like 19 and or something? And then Craig McEwen, everyone knows. Um, and Freddie's always put me in with solid pro, solid pro, solid pro. So then you go into amateurs, and, and the, the pace is real quick, but the style's different. So I'm enjoying knowing that I have, you know, to start four three minute rounds and that means I still got to be busy but I can go in there establish my jab and have a little more time to actually set punches up. Now is it going to bother you not to have headgear or not wearing a t-shirt? Of course I don't want to wear a t-shirt or headgear. No that won't bother me. Some people it does you'd be surprised. Nah I'm, I'm looking forward to taking it off. Okay now when do you know when you're ready for your pro debut? I guess when you're in the ring. Got it. That's well, it. good luck. We're going to catch up with you after your fight and your victory, I'm sure. Thank you very much. Zachary Kid Yamaka Wallman, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you.